Run 500 instances of the protein test task with distinct samples. Once 400 of these have completed, cancel the remaining instances and initiate the next task. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on BPMN and workflow patterns. Today we look at the cancelling partial join for multiple instance pattern. Within a given process instance, multiple concurrent instances of a task, say M, can be created. The required number of instances is known when the first task instance commences. Once N of the task instances have completed, where N is less than M, the next task in the process is triggered and the remaining M minus N instances are cancelled. You can see the behavior in the original flash animation. So first we select the total number of instances, so I will select 3, and then the total number of instances that have to complete, so I will select 2. So it starts here, we have our three instances in the multi-instance task. We complete one, we complete two, and then we are done. In BPMN this can be modeled and automated using a multi-instance task with a completion condition. When we run the process, five instances are created, not 500 for obvious reasons. Then we run the protein tests, one, two, three, and four. After the fourth one, the completion condition, which has been set to 4, evaluates to true. This causes the cancellation of the remaining instance of run protein test and the completion of the multi-instance task. After writing the report, the process instance is finished. If you want to check how this works, check out the BPMN file from the supplementary material. The link is below. Thank you for watching.